Hello, my name is Dan Carey. I'm a construction education consultant with the Anchorage School District in Anchorage, Alaska. Haven't always had that job. Initially, I was an elementary school teacher, did that for 22 years, followed that up with eight years of middle school material science, sort of a shop class. After those 30 years, I retired, and in the past six years, I have uh, been traveling around with these simulators uh, to the different schools around Anchorage. Initially, we had five extremely large, heavy, expensive simulators. It was real hard getting the kids and the simulators together. Transportation was just a nightmare. But now that we have the Simlog simulators, they're a lot lighter, a lot more portable, and far less expensive. Currently we have 35 simulators. We have 15 that travel around the middle schools. Those 15 middle school simulators, they have wheel loader loaded on them. Our 20 high school simulators, they have forklift, wheel loader, bulldozer, and hydraulic excavator loaded on them. Setup for these things is extremely easy. With a class of students, I can come in, we can unload the Pelican cases, put the simulators together, 20 simulators, we can do it in about 20 minutes with all the kids working together. These simulators travel around our school district. They spend about three weeks at a given school and then we pop them back into the Pelican cases and send them back uh, to the next school. In the short time that we've had these simulators, our students, uh, about 5,000 students have spent some time on the simulators. In fact, they've logged about 40,000 hours of operating time on the simulators. Simulators are more than just for uh, career exploration. In fact, uh, you can get very deep into the, the, uh, the skills of heavy equipment operation with these. And in fact, uh, Bartlett High School on the east side of Anchorage is going to be starting this next fall a, a heavy equipment operators course, a full semester course, and that's probably going to be followed up at other schools in the very near future.